also none to run the app is extremely accessible for someone that's visually impaired and for the blind I'll show you how I access the app using my voiceover on my iPhone I absolutely love it the one big well there's many things that our community is fighting for um, is just to one mental health has been a really big focus for the last couple of years because we understand the seclusion and feeling alone and um, some negative reactions from caretakers or just depression, anxiety, PS, PTSD, all those things within the blind, visually impaired community. But also exercise, being active, getting outside. So I decided to take a hit way on that in my life by becoming a runner and I'm definitely a beginner. But how do I run with the visual impairment? I use my white cane sometimes or I use a sighted guide behind me or I use both. Healthcare and fitness folder. Five apps. Open. None to run. Last run. N2R week 2 day 1. 1 1.4. Running. Image. N2R week 2 day 1. Running. Running. Outdoor bullet apple watch. Overview. August 10th. 5.45 p.m. 6.11 p.m. 0 hours. Temperature. Humidity. 82 degrees, 53%. Share work, send workout, workout detail, workout time, elapsed time, 26, 0, 1, 0 hours, 26 minutes, and 1 set distance. Average pay, 1.45 mi, 17, 56 slash, run pace, walk pay, 16, 18 slash mi, 18, 38 slash mi, total step, step slash, 3300, 127, average. Max, 131 BPM. Messages. Now. Plus. Notification. Messages. Now. Plus. 1, 3, 2, 5, 2, 4, 0, 5, 3. Screen recording in progress. 12, 6. Or, you know, sometimes I use my cane and a sighted guide if my peripheral was just not hitting that day because my eyes are extremely fatigued from working. I'm using my wearable technology and assistive tech. It happens. Um, this is a degenerative disease, so it gets worse. So right now I have been able to um, have a status quo, but I know in the future it may pick up and, and get worse. But anyway, so sometimes I use both. Sometimes I just use a sighted guide because I run on an extremely, really well paved trail. And if I run off of it, it goes onto grass so I can feel the difference. And my sighted guide usually tells me, go left, go right, go straight, slow down. So day two, week two, none to run. I had to drag myself out of the bed went to Sam's Club and it literally drained my pocketbook and my energy. So much people, so much sensory overload. It was not an enjoyable experience at all. Yeah, it was my very first time shopping at Sam's Club. I definitely did get a bang for my bucks. I think the groceries I got will last for a long time, but man oh man, I had to recuperate. But let's go ahead and get this run the books. Deuces. Oh, I gotta stretch first. Okay, it's not so bad. It's hot as heck outside, but there's also a nice breeze blowing. I'm gonna try a new place, a new trail. Why not? Let's trail it out. One interval or seven run intervals in these 25 minutes. So I'm on the first one. Did not feel like running at all. So I pushed myself because I got two runs to finish this week. So I gotta do one today and one tomorrow. So let's get it done. I'm doing my two minute first walk. This trail is really, really well paved, but oh my god, it's hilly. So, I'm really testing my stamina and endurance today. <laughs> Come on, White King, don't let me down. Run two. Um, my favorite 
tip to use for running is the marshmallow tip. I definitely need to get it replaced. But I also like the tip, I call it the flying UFO because it's like a flattened disc. I'm sure that's not the name for it. But the worst tip you could possibly ever run with is the pencil tip. And I have two canes with a pencil tip, very traditional white cane. And I'll show you what those look like when I get home. But yeah, do not use the pencil tip to run. Run free. So I really can't concentrate on my pace much because my white cane, you know, gives me, excuse the pun, a handicap. But I just want to be outside, enjoy the fresh air, get some movement and blood running through my veins. I feel good. It's hot as heck out here. My calves have been tight lately, so I find that it takes a minute for my legs to warm up, but I push through. Mind over matter. Run for it. My legs are not too tight. I'm gonna make it. the mechanics of running with my white cane is the equivalent of like patting your head and rubbing your stomach at the same time. It just feels awkward, but I'm getting used to it. Almost done.